Keon, this week's game is in conjunction with the Red Cross, the Tongan Recovery Appeal, mate. What does that mean to you? Oh, yeah, obviously it means a lot. Um, you know, it means a lot for the club being able to, you know, put a round on dedicated to, to Tonga and, you know, everything that they've been through. And, you know, it just shows, you know, it does have to be a lot of support, but, you know, dedicating a round, you know, means a lot for, um, you know, obviously me and the Tonga boys and our family. So, so yeah. And, and where were you when you found out the news about the tsunami, mate? Um, I think I was at home and I, I just woke up. Um, and then I seen like a lot of people on social media just saying pray for Tonga and I, I didn't know what uh, what happened so you know I dug deeper and found out that there was um you know volcano and that and you know the flooding and all that and um, it was pretty sad so I, I just pretty much went to my my family straight away and make sure everyone was uh, back home good um was all right and yeah lucky enough they're all right and they weren't affected by it eh? no my my family um, live more inland so um, you know everyone got told sort of move more inland to get away from the water. Um, yeah, so my family is a little bit more out, I say. And how many times have you been there? Because you, you grew up here, didn't you? Yeah, yeah I've, I've been there. I've been there once um, when I was younger. Um, you know, when I was a little bit, you know, still, well, it still is a third world country, but it's, it's developed a lot now. Um, but yeah, that was the last time I went. I think in 2010, um, that was the last time I went. What do you love about Tongan culture, mate? Nah, just family. Um, you know, from the day I was born, you know, my dad, Brandon knows my dad. Um, you know, everything's about family and. You know, you're nothing without your family, so that's that's pretty much the whole Pacific Island. Um, family's everything, so and that's that's what I love, yeah. And the shirt you're wearing, did you guys have anything to do with designing that, putting it um, together? Oh, no, um, the club, you know, we they, they helped us out with some ideas, and, you know, we didn't, you know, we were just throwing ideas up in the air, and then he um, said that he found the guy that designed the shirt. And, yeah, it was pretty good. Um, like, on the back, there's, like, waves um, to represent the tsunami and that, and then, um, like, little dots to the volcano ash and that. So, um, yeah, no, it was a good, good idea, yeah. Cool. And how would you pull up from the, the Melbourne game, mate, last Thursday night? A bit of a tough loss in the end? Yeah, it was a tough loss, but, you know, um, no, nah, I pulled up all right. Just a little bit sore. Obviously, start of the year, so the body's going to be sore than usual. Um, but, you know, the more we get into it, it'll be good. Uh, and how was JD after the game, mate? He's out on two in the hole at the moment, but yeah. uh, young coach, yeah. looking for his next win, eh? Yeah, no, he, he was positive. Um, there's a lot of positive to take out of it. Um, you know, we were positive too, you know. we Probably one of our worst games in recent memory, and... Um, you know, I think we completed 50, 60 percent, and we lost by one point in overtime against Melbourne in Melbourne too. So, you know, if we hold the ball for a few more sets, we might might win and you know take home the two points. But you know, it's only round two. Lucky it's not round 24, and you know we can just build. Yeah, well, the, the completion rate. If you just read that completion rate, you would have thought we'd get touched up by 20 or 30 in Melbourne. Yeah, yeah. But you got to take some positive defensively. You scrambled. There was plenty of effort there, mate. Yeah, no, that's all you can ask is effort and um, you know pretty much sacrifice for. You know, your lungs and that, you know, you're blowing out there. It's going to be a tough game, but, you know, we held on. You're pumped for the Roosters game this week, mate? Yeah, I can't wait. No worries, mate. Good luck, brother. No, I appreciate it. Thank you.